Today, I've got my title 910 weight reel. I've got salad dressing, my favorite pipe flyer. I've got my gray salt nine foot nine weight. I've got a long landing net with a rubber net because I will not plunge in there without a rubber on. It's that simple. Fish have a lot of slime. They need it for their bodies. Need it for their bodies. I don't want to take that away from them. I want to quest the capture pike <gasps> to camp the night and to live to tell the tale. This is Solo Dyke with the pike or pikes. Depends on how it goes. Or uck a blank. Solo dyke without a pike. Solo, just call it dyke then, couldn't I, really? All right, let's go. Now, some people take a lucky charm with them when they fish. It may be a photograph, some sort of keepsake, an old sock. I know for a fact Lee Morris takes his dead ferret. I, on the other hand, pray to the gods. Matt Hayes, god of pike, bringeth me a fish for thy hast the protruding tooth of strength bringeth a pike if you're not catching try it it'll work the thing about Matt Hayes is that he's got that tooth very much like I've got this tooth yeah and when you hone in on it, it basically tells you where the fish are. For instance. Yeah. That way. prematurely struck and I, th I think I trout struck also there's no right or wrong way send another I am rusty it's been a while we carry on when I see poos like this I say to myself do not camp in this field. What beast enters these fields? That it looks quite fresh. I need to leave. This is camp for tonight. I'm ready. I think I'm gonna be alone. Actually, I'm not. I've brought along a good friend of mine, Sharon. Sharon, meet the internet. Internet, meet Sharon. First time camping. I might get caught, you know. Considering, like, Wild Camping 101 states, like, set up before it gets dark. It's only the afternoon. This is for the Sharon. I've noticed there's a lot of jumping spiders. Not even regular spiders, jumping spiders. That's something I'm gonna have to get used to. I don't like spiders. Oh, beautiful. Right, Sharon, keep an eye on that. I just wanna get something from the tent. Sharon, where did the burger go? I 
I will ask you one more time, Sharon, where did the burger go? This is how it ends. Camping doesn't mean you have to be a dutty bitch. You can brush your teeth. So I do. Calling it a night. Charging up all my gear again. Uh, I usually skip with a telly on at home. So I wonder how it'd be for me. The jumping spiders seem to have f***ed off. Which is quite nice. See you in the morning where I'll get to eat all of my breakfast because that f***ing Sharon won't be around. How about that? I'm alive. I've made it through the night. There's these little, little droplets. Condensation, isn't it? This is a bit feeling like a bit moist. But, um, there's bugs. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. No wonder there's a little drop list. Jesus Christ, look at all the dew. Last night, I must say I was warm. But it was quite a... I mean, something rubbed up against my tent a couple of times. Yeah. Lucky thing. If you've never tried wild camping, give it a go. Think about it. What's the worst thing that could happen? You get murdered. <laughs> then you won't ever have to pay council tax ah. again. Every cloud. No one ever wants to talk about this, yeah? But I've had my coffee and it is practically diuretic. So now I need a poo. If I'm caught purposely pooing into a hole, <gasps> that's going to be worse than the time I accidentally had to poo and didn't get caught. Bottoms up. Leave no trace. It was an interesting experience. You got to, you got to make sure you get it into that hole, yeah. Because if you don't, you will have to push it into that hole. All right. Well, let's go. Let's catch a pike. Salad dressing again. How many times salad dressing? Oh, salad dressing, how you failed me. Oh, salad dressing. Right. Don't 
don't climb over fences like this with a heavy bag. Are there any animals? No, okay. Oh no! I don't want no problem. Away. Step back. You were all coming at me on purpose to try and intimidate me and I've come up to the countryside for a nice fight. <laughs> Get off my GoPro. Uh, uh, no. I'm just ready to slide down this branch, go to the other side, and I think I still might do that because they are. They come at me, mate. Homophobic, you lot. Probably. I don't understand horses. Yes, solo dyke with a one pike. Thank you, Matt Hayes. Beauty. So how am I feeling after that? Buzzing and terrified because I'm still in the horse field. So that's a problem. So that's it. I blanked. I camped out the night and on the last day when I thought all was lost, hope prevailed and I caught. Till next time. Imagine that the only pike I catch on the journey and I don't get any of the play that's like the main part. I'm not very good at this. There's a lot more room for improvement.